Loan service agency Mohila will lose millions of federal dollars after sending late bills to borrowers. It comes after student loan payments restarted at the beginning of the month following a pause of more than three years. Missouri Capitol Bureau Chief Joe McLean is in Jefferson City getting reaction from borrowers. The U.S. Education Department is withholding $7.2 million in payments to Mohila because of that mistake. It also told the company that it has to once again freeze the interest rate for those borrowers who are affected until the situation is resolved. The Missouri Higher Education Loan Authority, or MOHILA, is one of the agencies that the federal government hires to manage student loans and collect payments. But when student loan payments started back up this month after a three-year pause, some borrowers noticed that MOHILA seemed unprepared. That company just wasn't able to handle the switch, you know, when all of those, and you'd think what we would have learned by now to, like, make sure that MOHILA, like, was actually set up to handle everything when it switched over and it just wasn't. Jamie Renfro is one of more than 600,000 borrowers eligible for the Public Service Loan Forgiveness Program, which wipes the debt of any borrowers who worked in public service and made loan payments for 10 years. Renfro, an Iowa-based college professor, said she was finally done earlier this spring, but her account still says she owes money. After hours on hold with Mohila, she was able to speak with a staffer. Then she said, oh, you're calling from Iowa? And I said, yes. And she goes, oh, you need to call a different phone number. But the number she was given connected her to the local direct TV office. It was not for anything that had anything to do with student loans at all. It was for cable. So, um, and now I have been able, unable to get back through. Meanwhile, Nicole Johnson said getting her loan forgiveness processed took weeks. Yeah, I submitted all my documents by October 27, 2022. I didn't get emails about need to resubmit until February. She said she was eventually able to get through to Mohila by calling as early as possible and having all of her documentation ready. As of this summer, more than $29 billion in student debt is held by Missouri residents. In Jefferson City, Joe McLean, First Alert 4.